So where is my mommy? I would like to tell her that uh, love is harmless. Love does not crucify, does not harm anyone. But do you believe it, Zara? Well, now people have come, like Muji Baba, are telling us to listen to our hearts, from the heart listen to someone. And uh, this is uh, something that the mind uh, would not accept. ये दिमाग है जो कहता है प्यार फजूल है वो दिल है जो कहता है प्यार खूब है इन इंग्लिश इट मीन्स दिस माइंड दैट सेज लव इज यूसेस बट दैट हार्ट विच सेज Love is good and beautiful. So even in our religion, we were told to uh, accept the intuition. We have an intuition that tells us that God exists. The mind is not needed. It's the intuition which gives us the faith and the belief in God, the unseen. Just like uh, an example was given when, um, you know, we're about to die or uh, drowning, uh, we do try to uh, get uh, help or uh, rescue ourselves. So when we're screaming for help or trying to, uh, you know, get help, help ourselves, that's the God that we are calling out to. And uh, we have this self-defense uh, mechanism for the self, protection for the self. And so this uh, diary, in my diary, what I was writing during college years, uh, one thing I missed was that uh, in Father, De, uh, 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 sorry, Father DeMello's uh, cassette lecture, uh, there was another thing that life has become too mechanic. Uh, we human beings have become like machines, mechanical. So Father DeMello's uh, lecture was on life, what we've become and on uh, detachment uh, from uh, our treasures, what we are so attached to. And the principal had to give it to me. <laughs> Once I was like that uh, bit, you know, about truth and all, uh, what Mr. Sai had taught me. <laughs> Or, <laughs> or try to <laughs> teach me. <laughs> you are laughing, this means that <laughs> you are <laughs> you are hiding, lying, <laughs> lying. <laughs> uh, so anyways, uh, what I wrote was uh, uh, how the old Zara was with Mr. Sa. <laughs> And uh, it was uh, getting to me. Finally, it got to me um, that life is artificial, has become artificial. <laughs> and <laughs> unfortunately, the principal had to give me this cassette. <laughs> so I had to write what kind of an education is this uh, that uh, uh, puts li our lives in an executive's briefcase. <laughs> and uh, I didn't write anything about uh, why we work. <laughs> um, 
but there are needs to be fulfilled. And so I don't know how I came to the need part. And then I wrote that um, there, um, the, this need is terrible. I condemned it. And uh, not to, um, you know, uh, love is needless. I knew it in my heart. And so later on, I confused myself. I got confused and I didn't know what I had really wanted to write and convey. And yes, I also believe that uh, love never crucifies, never harms, never. Love is something that heals, never tests us. It's uh, like goodness, it stands on its own. It doesn't need evil uh, to uh, make us appreciate the good that is there, make us value the good. So uh, I've also come to the opposites of uh, things in creation. Uh, and uh, uh, is life a battlefield that we have to struggle to be good? And uh, there has to be evil for us to appreciate good. And yes, thanks much to Muji Baba who made me realize uh, during one of his uh, meditation, guided meditation, that um, there's no need to associate with anything. There's no need. And love joy, it's just out of love and joy that it is, it exists, and existence is. Thus, uh, this means that uh, there's uh, the opposite, there's no opposite of love. Hate is something different than uh, this hate doesn't make us appreciate love. Love stands on its own. So I was much confused and uh, someone later like Muji Baba right now came to remind me what the world has put in me is wrong. It's a uh, fake. And we must get to the original state, natural state of love and existence. So do I need someone else to remind me that love does not crucify or harm? This is where I've reached right now. Meaning, uh, do I need a, another godly person, blessed human being to remind me uh, where I should be and how I should feel and uh, what the truth is about life and existence. I started to believe too much in people, other people who we are all lost. May God guide us and open our eyes and hearts to the truth. Amen.